Guillotine was in tight. Props to both. And I'm, four, I'm 14 and I do MMA. I have a backyard fight club as well. Um, let me actually hold on a second. I think I looked it up earlier. Your channel. I don't see any fights on your channel. Otherwise, I would have looked at them. Um, yeah. Um, 14 is a good age to do it. We didn't start really. I mean, we didn't start doing anything until we were like 20 or 19, 20. So, yeah. Good on you, mate. Um, I'm glad you're doing that. Uh, guillotine wasn't tight. Very tight. God. We didn't tr We didn't drill. I'm, I, I kind of helped with Chiron. I didn't. I rarely gator roll. I rarely roll with chokes at all. I like to kind of put my legs over them, you know, keep it tight like that, keep them snug. Um, but I've only gator rolled Chiron once, and that was a long time ago, and that was just doing a random sparring session. Um, so he wasn't really prepared for that. But I think the issue was that he sprawled. After the flurry, he got nervous that Logan was going to body lock or take him down, so he did what we trained to do, which is sprawl, except for when he sprawled, he kind of tucked his head a little bit lower than Logan's, which as you may know, if you do MMA, you know, it kind of gives Logan the advantage to maneuver him. Got an arm in, arm in guillotine. I think that's what happened. You know, rolled him. Then when he, during a different role, he switched into just a straight guillotine. I think that's what it was. I don't remember. I, I, I even know like, I have edited it. There's no good camera angles. And I didn't have a good angle when I was refing to tell you exactly what it was. Um, but I think wrestling, it would be considered a guillotine. Um, yeah, but it was a gr really good gator roll. He did like, and when he got it, the last roll, I don't know if most people understand it or see it. It went from here. His, his forearm went from here to here. So it's like Chiron tapped. He had to tap. It was no option. I heard someone, I heard someone asked me once is like, why did he tap? I was like, let me do it to you and we'll see what happens. But uh, he had to tap. It was, it was, you know. When he, yeah, okay. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, yeah. Props to both. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm glad Siobhan showed up and did, uh, he showed a bits of the pieces of the game plan we wanted to do, and he didn't back out. He wasn't scared, at least not, yeah, he wasn't nearly as scared as he was when he fought me. He was confident in his ability, and he was humble. He was pretty much as humble as Siobhan can get, so. Yeah. And Logan, there's not, not much needs to be said on Logan. He's a fucking killer, so.